Welcome to InfoAssist, a web-based tool that makes reporting and data analysis easy. InfoAssist is a powerful tool that you can use to make sense of your data, identify trends in it, and turn it into intuitive reports, charts, visualizations, and documents that you can distribute throughout your organization to share your insights. Let's take a look. You can open InfoAssist to create content directly from the WebFocus homepage, or by right-clicking a domain or folder in your repository pointing to New, and selecting the type of content you'd like to create. You can access all of the most common functions right from the Quick Access Toolbar, or the Application menu, where you can save, select, or run your reports. The InfoAssist features are available up front on the ribbon, which is divided into different tabs by functionality. As you begin developing content in InfoAssist, the options and functionality available to you change, so you have access to what you need to build easily. All of the fields from your selected data source are available in the Data pane, while the fields that make up your current report show up in the Query pane. Here, when you build different types of content, such as a report or visualization, the field containers change. For reports, you have sum, by, and across field containers. For visualizations, you have matrix, axis, and marker containers. You can also use the Filter pane to filter this data. Simply drag a data field to the Filter pane to create a simple filter. Any changes you make to your report will display in the canvas in the live preview mode, or in the query design pane in the query design view. Creating new reports is easy. Just select your data source and you're ready to go. Double click the fields in the data pane to add them to your report, or drag them to the filter pane to filter your data. Once you've created a report, you can also style it. Just select a field and you'll immediately have access to its styling options which range from changing the font size, style, and color to adding data bars or traffic lights. Before saving your report, you can also create a thumbnail, which will help you identify your report on the WebFocus homepage. By default, the format of your report output is configured as HTML, which runs your report as a standard HTML report in a browser. You can switch your report output format to a variety of options, including Active Report, which makes your report more interactive by enabling you to dynamically sort and filter on the report, PDF, Excel, Excel with formulas, Excel CSV, and PowerPoint formats. In addition to the options that we discussed, you can further customize and stylize your report to include filters, format themes and banding, enable auto-drill or auto-linking, and more. You can create charts similarly to how you create a report. Once you select your data, you can double-click your fields to add them to your chart. The default type is a bar chart, but there are a variety of other chart types available, from pie charts to maps and plenty of other options. You can use the options on the status bar to change the output location or format at any time, or switch between your open reports and charts. When you run your report or chart, you'll see a preview of it in the output window. In addition to all of this, InfoAssist also gives you the ability to create robust visualizations, which can display multiple charts to convey even more information at a glance, and documents containing your own reports and charts. If you need help at any time, just click the Help menu. To learn more, visit the WebFocus 8205 Knowledge Base, where you can search all technical topics and videos.